Hello everybody, I am Saint Enix. Welcome back, it's been a minute. Nice to see everybody. How you been doing? Alright, so, big update. Fallout Shelter is now on Steam. And I got the save files to work. I'm going to show you how. As you can see, it's running right here. We're going to go ahead and minimize that. Show you. Fallout Shelter. And the vault list. I have two copies of Vault 999 in there because I was messing around with it. And Vault 989 is the one that I made just to poke around and see where the save files would be. So let's go ahead and load this one up. This is the first one I loaded. I've already done a few things in it. Might get attacked as soon as it loads. I also don't know how Steam is going to react to this. So maybe on the safe side, don't use your main Steam account, especially if you've got a lot of games you've paid for and stuff like that. Just I'll update you guys if anything happens. You know, if there's any kind of... Uh, you know, banning issues. But, uh, yeah, it works. I'm going to show you guys where to put it. The save file, that is. <laughs> you might have to enable hidden files and folders. So go into your start menu, click on type hidden, show hidden files, and make sure this is selected, this radio button right here. It's, it's default to this. Click it over, hit apply. Then you want to go into your C drive, users, whatever your computer name happens to be, whether it's Joe, Bob, Billy Joe, Bob, Captain Fancy Pants, I don't know what you call your computer. But then you go to App Data, Local, Fallout Shelter, and that's where all your save files will be. Now when you paste in, oh I don't have it still pasteable, when you paste in like a, a save of mine from my site, it's going to have my name on it. So it'll be Vault 999 or Vault 10 or Vault 7 or whatever. You'll need to change that number. So you just either click on it and then wait a second, click on it again, or you can right click, go to rename, and change the, well, not, the not the backup, but you do it like this. There you go. Rename. Change the number to 1, 2, or 3. Those are the only spots. There's only three save spots. So you have to change the number to 1, 2, or 3. And then that's it. Don't do it while it's running because it won't update and load the save into the save slot. Do it, you know, start the game, download it, get it all running, exit out of everything, close Steam, switch the save files in, restart Steam, and should work just fine. But if you guys have any issues, please leave a comment down below. Also look forward to more new content, so hit the subscribe button if you'd like to see that. Fallout 4... I got Fort Light coming up. It's insane. A huge sanctuary build. Um, one other thing I'd like to say before I end this video is thank you so much, guys. I appreciate all your support. Over a quarter million views and 800 subscribers. I'm so grateful for like all the time you guys have spent with me. Because you guys have spent your time watching my videos, and I appreciate that. And shout out to Stefan Molyneux. I'd love to have a conversation with you sometime. You're a very smart individual, my friend. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to hit that like button if this worked for you. Dislike if it didn't, and leave a comment. Let me know. Maybe we can work it out. Um, also, any updates. If Steam gives you guys trouble, please let me know. I will tell you guys, too, as soon as that ever... If that happens, I will let you know as soon as possible. On the safe side, use a throwaway account. Just to be safe. You know. But... Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a good one.